it's already December 7th. One of these days I should do a happy birthday video for my daughters that I actually post on their birthdays and I totally forget. Someone remind me next year to do a video for my daughters on their birthdays. Or a wife video to post on her birthday. She might like that. Oh, I must have set a waypoint to go discover this truck dealer. I'm like, where am I going? Uh, am I in the U-turn lane? I guess I am in the U-turn lane. Hello, Austin. Oh, it's a Volvo dealership. Actually, you know what? As long as I'm here, I might as well stop and get my truck done for Christmas. Hey everybody, old guy gamer here, playing American Truck Sim. Looks like I made $100,000 just going to sleep. I am in Austin, Texas. And don't even worry about the load that's on the back of the truck, because that's a whole story. Ugh, I don't even want to talk about it. But anyways, I uh, put a waypoint here to discover this dealership. It's a Volvo dealership in Austin, Texas. Because I got to get set the truck set up for Christmas. So let me go show you what I'm going to do. I don't know. What's the fun stuff? The driving or the configuring? Configuratoring. All right. Right now we have the 8x4 mid-lift 150 gallon. I've been complaining. I've been saying for a long time that if I ever change the configuration, it'll be to get rid of the lift axle because it shortens up these fuel tanks so much. I've only got 150 gallon I just did a 2,200 mile trip from Oregon to Texas and I had to refuel like four times. It sucked. So I, did, I didn't have to refuel four times. I just refueled four times because I didn't want to get low because I only have 150 gallons. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of this lift axle, uh, hopefully keep the long frame and hopefully get more fuel capacity. So short eight by four. Long. Oh no. Yeah, I don't want that. Eight by six. Yeah, let's do it. whatever we got to do. Eight by four mid lift. So six by four. Ugh. That's a great looking truck, but no, that's not what I want. Six by two mid lift. Nope. Uh, six by four, two twenty. I want a day cab though. I like the long frame, but I want a day cab. You can actually see the differential there changing. You see it? Something down here changed. Uh, let me see if I can get a better picture of that changing as it happens. So this is the drive. This is the drive axle right here. You can tell because when I hit six, this is a six by two with that one being the drive axle. When you, when I click six by four, you'll see another differential pop up there. There you go. Six by two mid lift, six by two, 220. None of these are what I want because I don't want a sleeper. I want a day cab. I'm, everything I do is backwards because I say I want this thing to be a long haul truck, but then I don't want a sleeper on it. I want it to be a day cab. Oh, so short. <laughs> so sad. I want it to be a long truck with two axles in the back. Uh oh. Don't want that. Six by four, 150. Oh, do I want to go to this? To get 50 more gallons of fuel. I'll be back. I gotta go check the mail. We're in the middle of a video. Alright, still recording. Still recording. Gotta text my wife, tell her the stuff's in the fridge. Oh, oh, 
man. All right, I'm back. All right, you'll have to forgive me. Ugh, I took a break. I had to go get some stuff from the outside. Package got delivered and... Oh, no, I'm just going through a little bit of a coughing fit. Going to recover from that and see where I was at. All right, here we are. So this is the typical truck you see. Ugh. I don't know if you guys saw the video or not, but do you remember when I first did a, a thing with Cop Out? I did a video with Cop Out and... Uh, he saw my truck like this with the big fiery paint job and he's like, oh my God, that looks so cool. That's what I want people to think when they see my truck. The problem is, is this thing only has 150 gallon fuel tanks. Ugh. Maybe I could do a little bit of a sleeper. Eight by six, my goodness, is that six driven? Wow, could you imagine the fuel economy on six driven wheels? How ridiculous that would be that gives me more flexibility at least I'm gonna to have to go with a sleeper on the cab I think that's what I'm gonna do guys and girls because I mean this is the same frame same length same setup as what I've been going with but it does give me the longer fuel tanks I just have to live with having a sleeper I wanted it to be a day cab but Whatever, maybe I'll be able to put more lights on it or something. Maybe it'll pay off in the long run. Let me uh, get these wheels. I don't even know what wheels I have on here. All right, let's go look at the paint. Got to pick a Christmas paint job. Let's do that. I think this is an option. You have to spend a couple bucks in the store to get these paint jobs, but let's go through these and pick one. That's a little too dark for my chrome setup, I think. Wait, 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 wait. I gotta have more Santa ones than that. There's the Christmas ones. Here we go. Santa's sled. I've only got two to pick from. Look at that color, though. That is pretty sharp. It's like a blue silver. Like I would call that like silver ice, maybe. Because it looks blue and it looks silver. Problem is, it doesn't give you the color options to change it at all. It has to be this color. I like the ones where they give you the option to change it. Wow, that is very sharp. It's kind of plain, but it's sharp. Oh, there's a window in the back of the sleeper. I just now noticed that. All right, do we go with the uh, blue ice? Blue steel? Blue, I think blue ice works better. Um, or the red. I do like the red. That is showy color. Or do we go with this dark blue? Oh, man. I have no idea what I'm doing, guys. All right. Let's make sure we got the biggest, baddest, everything we can do. Let's do it. Let's do the 300-gallon tanks. I'll put up with the extra wear and tear to get the 300-gallon tanks. All right, we're going to spend $73,000 to buy our Christmas truck. We are in the middle of a job. Let's do it. Oh, there's a Home Depot. Got to go pick up some deck screws. Then we'll hit the gas. Look at our nose mirror first. It's all clear. Go, go, go. Abilene and Dallas, let's do Do I still have Billy Goat Gruff over there? I sure do. Looking out in the windy. Got the other cars there. Wichita Falls. Thank goodness I discovered it because that's where I'm headed. Nice and slow so we don't get the paint job dirty. Let's go buy a trailer. Oh, there she is. 
Let's do the 53 two axles. Front. There's no Christmas. Um, let's go with custom. External contract or external? I want external market because I have a trailer. Oh, I can take a water pitcher. That is a long route. Let's do our Christmas video.